Looking for a quick and delicious meal for every day? Well, you're in luck. Today, we're exploring the delightful world of Italian cuisine with a classic, pasta with tomato sauce. This dish is not only mouth-wateringly good, but also incredibly easy to make. It's perfect for those busy weeknights when you're pressed for time, but still craving something homemade, hearty, and satisfying. So without further ado, ready those aprons, and get set to whip up a delectable meal. First things first, gather all the ingredients. For this recipe, we're going to need some pasta. 200 grams of spaghetti or any pasta of your choice will do the trick. Next, you'll need to grab 2 tablespoons of olive oil to saute our garlic. Speaking of which, you'll need 2 cloves of garlic minced to perfection. Then we have 400 grams of diced tomatoes in their juice. This will form the base of our delicious tomato sauce. To balance out the acidity of the tomatoes, we'll add in 1 teaspoon of sugar. Of course, we can't forget the essentials, salt and pepper to taste. And finally, we're going to garnish our dish with some fresh basil leaves. Not only do they add a pop of color, but they also give our pasta that extra oomph of flavor. Now that we have all our ingredients, it's time to get cooking. Start by cooking the pasta. Now, each brand and type of pasta has its own cooking time, so make sure to check the instructions on the package. The key to perfectly cooked pasta is boiling it in salted water. The salt enhances the flavor of the pasta, giving it a taste that will stand out even when you mix it with the sauce. Remember, the water should be at a rolling boil before you add the pasta. Once you've poured it in, stir it occasionally to ensure the pasta doesn't stick together or to the bottom of the pot. Keep an eye on the clock so you don't overcook it. We want our pasta to be al dente, that perfect state of being firm to the bite yet cooked through. While the pasta is boiling, we don't just sit and watch. No, we're multitaskers here. So, let's get started on that delicious tomato sauce. Now, let's move on to the star of the show, the tomato sauce. Our sauce begins with a base of olive oil, so take a deep pan and pour in a couple of tablespoons. Set your stove to medium heat and let the oil warm up. It won't take long. You're looking for a gentle shimmer, not a furious boil. Next, it's time to add some flavor. Two cloves of minced garlic should do the trick. Toss them into the pan and saute them until they're golden brown. The aroma of the garlic sauteing in the olive oil will fill your kitchen with an irresistible scent. Now, for the main event. You'll need about 400 grams of diced tomatoes in their own juice. Add them to the pan. The sizzling sound as they hit the hot oil is music to a cook's ears. To balance the acidity of the tomatoes, we add a teaspoon of sugar. It's a small amount, but it makes a world of difference. Then season with salt and pepper to your liking. Once everything's in the pan, give it a good stir. Let it bubble, simmer and reduce over medium heat for around 10 minutes. The sauce will thicken and the flavors will meld together beautifully. Patience is key here. The longer it cooks, the deeper the flavors. Once your sauce is ready, it's time to combine everything together. Enjoy the process because the result is going to be delicious. Now for the final step, combining the pasta and the sauce. The moment we've been building up to has arrived. The pasta is cooked to perfection and the sauce is simmering with flavor. It's time to unite these two components into a harmonious masterpiece. Here's how we do it. Take your cooked pasta and gently add it to the simmering sauce. Now this part is crucial. We don't just dump the pasta in. We coax it into the sauce, introduce them to each other. Remember, we want every strand of pasta to be acquainted with the sauce, to be enveloped in its rich, tomatoey goodness. So with the patience of a maestro, stir the pasta into the sauce. Watch as the sauce clings to the pasta as they become one. Keep stirring until every piece of pasta is coated in the sauce until they're inseparable. Garnish the pasta with fresh basil and serve hot. Bon appetit! And there you have it. In six simple steps, we've made a delightful pasta dish. We started by boiling our pasta of choice, then sautéed minced garlic and olive oil for a flavor-packed base. 
We then added crushed tomatoes, a touch of sugar, and seasoned to taste. After simmering our sauce, we combined it with our cooked pasta, ensuring every strand was coated. Topped with fresh basil. This dish is as versatile as it is easy to prepare. Enjoy this quick and delicious meal any day of the week. Until next time, happy cooking!